Hi everyone, Sabrina Woodworth here with Work Lessons 101 and today's question is why do you need to be authentic? So this question came up because I wrote an article, I guess blogged last week for Upkey, which is a Chicago startup company, um, on the three career tips I wish I knew from day one of my career. And number two that I stated was make a connection while being authentic. And I had several questions come in this week about if I could elaborate on that. There's three reasons I think being authentic is critical. Uh, the first one is career last decades. 40 years potentially. So if you're just starting out your career or you're doing a career transition, be authentic to who you are. Don't fake it. Um, if you fake who you are, that's going to eventually become a full-time job. Uh, it's exhausting just to think about trying to fake who you are every single day at work. It's not good, It's not a good stance to take. Um, find a company that fits who you are, that you fit into their company culture. It's important. It's good for your mental health, your physical health. Careers last decades. Um, you need to curb your personality at times, obviously, if you're around clients, higher ups in your organization organization, if you're around children, you're going to need to know your audience and curb your personality towards that. For example, um, I'm an ex-hockey player myself and I have been known to let a few good four-letter adjective words out of my mouth, but I obviously watch my mouth when I'm around my clients, when I'm around children, um, or people who would be offensive um, by using strong uh, foul language, for example. That's just curbing my personality. That's not changing who I am. Number two, I would say, is why I said make a connection while being authentic, is your career is going to be built off a strong network. And strong networks are built off strong relationships. And strong relationships are built off trust. If you fake who you are, you're going to have a much harder time building long-lasting, trusting, strong relationships because people are simply not going to trust you if they think they're faking it. People are perceptive. They'll pick up on fakers. And last but not least, why being authentic I think is a superpower is the corporate world is full of fakers. It's full of people that will tell you what you want to hear and not what you need to hear. They won't tell you the truth. They're not transparent. If you're authentic, curb your personality when required, you know your audience, you can be who you are and go up the corporate ladder. You will be rare. Being authentic is a rare trait. There's a lot of people who aren't true who they are or they don't even know who they are. They don't have strong character. Don't be those people. Be rare. Be true to who you are. Find a company where you fit the company culture and find your home. That is my advice to you. If you have any questions, please reach me on my social media. Um, or my website, Work Lessons 101. So to recap, careers last decades, be who you are, don't fake it. It's going to be exhausting over decades of your career if you're not true to who you are. Relationships are built on trust. In the corporate world, being authentic is rare. All right, hopefully that was helpful. Talk to you later.